I've been in two relationships. Each one was like exactly three months, and that's it. Six cumulative months out of 24 years. <sighs> Sad. I don't know, I just, I've done so much, and I've worked so hard, and it's like a hopeless cause, you know? I mean, I do, I seem to do my best at finding people when I'm on, like, trips and stuff. I go on cruises by myself, or I, I've been on a cruise by myself, which was so much fun. I loved it. Um, met the greatest people, I mean, even though they weren't, like, people I'd normally be friends with, it was all kinds of neat people, and I just loved it. We went on an Alaskan cruise, and, oh, it's just beautiful up there. I mean, it's just, it was so neat. Uh, but for some reason, some part of me does not want a relationship. Uh, I don't know why. Um... I don't know. My, th my therapist actually said, well, no, I'm convinced you do want a relationship, you know. So, so I was like, so what is it? And he thinks I'm just set not setting off the right vibes, which makes sense now. Now my question is, why was I single all the rest of my life? I don't know. If I just genetically single? That's, that's all I can think of. And... So I've been working on it. I've been working on it for, well, I've been working on for about a couple months just on being attractive. Um, I just have been really improving my image lately, and uh, I'm a lot cooler than I used to be. Uh, I've uh, been styling my hair. I actually do the hair thing, you know. Um, uh, that's probably a mess now, but... Um, Started styling my hair. I started buying club clothes and dressing up um, in uh, club wear and wearing spandex shirts and you know all those hot little gay shirts and stuff. And uh, it's a uh, it's made a difference. I have a lot more fun now. I didn't ever think that that would matter. You know, I mean, I was convinced it wouldn't make any difference, and I would wear a t-shirt and jeans no matter what I did. Unchuck t-shirt and jeans and. And uh, now I like, I look nice. I mean, I look like GQ boy or like, you know, Calvin Klein man or whatever. And uh, a friend of mine, good friend of mine, Stacy, uh, she was, I don't only see her every month or so, but, but uh, she's been a friend since high school. And uh, uh, she, she said, uh, she saw me in what, like this black spandex thing I was wearing and she was like, wow so nice all this stuff and uh, that made a difference you know I mean I just really feel like I've been changing inside and I feel good I feel good and it's a good thing the room's still a mess my whole apartment is a pigsty but I'm gonna work on that. I think that cleanliness is like, is a reflection of your self-confidence and your self-worth. I really think that you, whether or not you style your hair, how you dress, you know, whether or not you tuck in your shirt and wear belts because they look nicer, whether or not you clean your apartment, it's all a product of your, of your self-worth, which I never thought that before. Now I do. <sighs> gonna throw a party at some point, but uh, 